But it's Adu. One way I could see the Sans thing being true. What if they got the announcer to literally s just say... Oh wait, is this actually Lima? Yeah, I, I lean towards this being Lima. It plays like him. Oh dear, I messed up. I think Falcon Bayo is even personally grace and glory, but I can understand you thinking that. Stop it. Okay, that was kind of interesting. I think it's even personally, but... Oh, and he left? What a cheeser. Well, that's Lima in a nutshell. <laughs> Wow, that just killed Raw. Brebe, I'm definitely interested in seeing what Violet is like, just out of curiosity. But I'm also curious to know as to what the rest of the patch is going to be like as well. Maybe some nerfs, maybe some buffs, maybe some fixes. Maybe universal changes, like Perry having more advantage. Maybe online fixes. You really don't know. And I'm just really curious to see what it all ends up being. I mean, it's not inconceivable, Lee Hargit. I'm not banking on it by any means, but... I'm not banking against it either. I mean, anything's possible, Tote Controls. You really don't know. Online fixes could be possible. Maybe they'll change other things. Maybe they'll give us a stage hazard toggle to where we can turn stage hazards on or off, literally on the character select or the stage select screen. If they did that, we could run uh, hazard stages legal with no issues. Do I think Violet might have secondary potential? I lean towards no, but. 
What? We'll see. But yeah, my first impression of Violet is that they probably wouldn't be like that much of a thing for me. I've definitely had times where I didn't believe in Falcon. But one thing I've always believed in is myself. So, that's helped me through a lot of those. I think Mars winning Genesis is pretty neat. Um, but listen to this. Oh, no, 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 I didn't mean to do this. Let's go! Alright, understandable. Have a nice day. Or, intendable. Okay, thank you some witty. I thought I landed on stage. Well, we're not doing that again. The Larry vs. Leo set? A little sad. I really wanted Larry to win, but... Man... I feel like after what Cosmos did at, a uh, Let's make big moves... People might finally start thinking, you know what? I think he is the worst character in the game. And if anyone deserves buffs, it's him. Man, I can't... We're one day away from uh, the final DLC character, Fighter Pass 1. I'm really interested in seeing uh, what else we get to because... The, the fact that they said there were character adjustments implies that there's, you know... When you consider that Violet was... Uh, most likely finished around November, that extra time combined with them saying that there are character adjustments means there's probably like some notable buffs, maybe some notable nerfs. Like can you imagine if like they gave Pikachu the same thing they did for his hurt box that they did for Pichu? I think I'm just understanding the game itself more and more in general, which is one of the reasons I think that I've been doing better as well at tournaments. The game just makes more and more sense to me over time. And for me, matchup knowledge is so important that... That really starting to figure out more matchups is what puts everything else together, honestly. Dude, Nisisko, I actually don't think it's that bad, funnily enough, anymore. But hey, this weekend I've got my uh, chance to prove that that's actually the case because... Meister is going to be at the tournament I'm at this weekend, so... A lot of it is just staying around the center of the stage. Controlling center stage is everything against this character. Because a lot of what Game & Watch wants to do in neutral... ...is uh, use their smash attacks to scare you into going to the ledge. Because once they have you at the ledge, they can really control space effectively with their hitboxes and dash attack. And it's really hard for Game & Watch to... Uh, like, pin people down, unless you pin yourself down by being scared of their smash attacks. So just getting around that and trying to hold center stage in spite of that is the key to beating this character. Because right now, like, the reason you see, like, Meister just spam smash... He's not even spamming smash attacks. He's just making you be like, okay, I can't be here. And once you feel like you can't be there, then he can just corner you to the ledge and like, pin you with back airs, with dash attack, and get you off stage. But it, it requires you to be fa scared. Therefore, you must not be. Easier said than done, but that's how you do it. Oh, baby. When you feel tense while playing, what, how do you loosen up to suck less? Ha! <laughs> I wish I had a good answer to that.
One of my biggest problems as a player is... Okay, I definitely deal with some nerves. 